last year. She had to do another one all over. Come look. Oh no, I broke the egg. Egg painting isn't all it's cracked up to be. Hmm. So this is gonna take a while for me to redo this and I'm very much behind everyone. So we're gonna use the magic of television to uh, speed this up. There we go. Have a bath. <laughs> so the other day when I was walking home from work, somebody actually stopped me and talked to me about a hot button topic. It's amazing to think that our hot button topics are hot enough. And here's another in Hot Button. Welcome to Hot Button. Today we discuss video games versus playing outside. What do you prefer to do, Chance? I prefer to play video games, you know. It's easier to meet people online. Um, just because where I am, there's nobody in my age group. It's all older adults or it's all little kids, you know. So I don't want to be stuck all around that, so it's easier to play video games for me and meet people online, make new friends over there. What do you like to do for fun? Well, I actually, I really like to go outside. Uh, I work at the computer most days, so I spend a lot of time sitting down and communicating with people only through email. So I really need to get out more often. Uh, however, I have a lot of friends that just love playing video games. What's your favorite game, Chance? Well, I have a couple of uh, games that I do enjoy, but my all-time favorite game is um, NHL 15. Just because it's so easy to play, it uh, deals with sports, you know, I like sports, I enjoy sports. So yeah, that's one of my favorite games to play. Well, I usually go out, sometimes even not because I want to, but because my dogs drag me outside. And I mean, let's be honest, you know, sometimes I'd rather stay inside, but no, no matter what kind of weather, I always have to go. But I have to say, I mean, I've seen some great video games recently, and uh, the environments that one plays in really look great. I would just love to go and see what's there, what's in that world, and just explore it without necessarily shooting anybody, though. Yeah, I agree, you know, there's this thing called the Oculus Rift and um, it's a pair of glasses that you can put on and you can just stay in one spot and you can look around and it shows you all these different sights and all these different views. You know, I, I like to do that too instead of just going around and getting shot at every day. Yeah, see, I would do games. that. Yeah. I would totally watch something like that. I would spend a lot of time on it probably. Yeah. <laughs> and. I have to confess, many years ago I did used to play games. I loved sci-fi games and uh, I loved flying planes with the joystick. Yeah, I don't remember those uh, joystick times, but um, I do remember flying planes when I was a kid, you know, with video games. So I enjoyed doing that as well. Um, but yeah, video games sure have changed from what they used to be a couple of years back. Yeah, they're a lot more realistic now, aren't they? Yeah, very realistic uh, uh -huh. now. Well, because I don't play as many video games right now, you know, I really love going outside. And some of the things I love about going outside are being with nature, looking at all the different animals, looking at the, the weather. The blue sky really makes me happy. Uh, smelling all the wonderful scents that are outside, especially now in the spring. Although being Chilliwack sometimes is not so great, is it? <laughs> but if I had that virtual reality game that you talk about, I would definitely, definitely try it. And it'd be like being a tourist in your own home. What kind of system do you use to play your games, Chance? Well, I have two systems, but um, the system that I use most is my PlayStation 4, just because it's easier access for me to get to, because it's in my office, which I'm mostly in all the time anyway, and my Wii that I have is downstairs with, my, with one of my other family members, and it's just hard to get down there because, you know, access in the house. I like the Wii, you know, it gives you the little bit of exercise, uh, but which one do you find it has the most games? The one that I find that has the most games is definitely the PlayStation 4. I've seen a ton of games for that. Yeah, and so I'm curious because you like video games. Are you very competitive when you play online with other people or are you pretty nice to them? Well, it depends on the person, you know. I'm actually competitive when I need to be. But for the most part, I'm a nice person, you know, I'll help out if anybody needs help. If, if nobody's understanding the game, you know, I'll do my best to help them all over the microphone, you know, online. But for the most part, I'm nice, not as competitive as I could be. And do you play in teams with them? So maybe uh, one of them is controlling the troops on the ground and somebody else, and you're doing the helicopter, 
or do you just play against them? Well, I have a friend that I met online, so I play, I play with him a lot, and um, basically we team up. And if anybody gives him a hard time, I'll back him up. If anybody gives me a hard time, he'll back me up. You know, so we got each other's backs. It does sound a little bit like when I go to the dog park. You know, I watch their back, they watch my back. And you know, just like you, my dogs really like to win all the time. They're really alpha males. You know, dogs like to um, be alpha, you know. So everybody wins. You gotta go bigger, you gotta go home. Hey, but that's not fair. I have small dogs. Well, they can be big, you know. They like to try to be big. <laughs> um, what, how about you guys at home? What do you think? Would you rather play video games or would you go, rather go out and meet people in the real world? Let us know on our Facebook and Twitter. Thank you for watching this episode of Hot Button, and we shall see you guys on the next one. Well, that does it for this week's episode of Go Fraser Valley. Look at my egg. Beautiful, Can I isn't it? it? Can I hold yeah, it? Yeah, what do you think? What do you think? Yeah. Beautiful? It's beautiful. Well, remember, you can find us online if you search Shaw TV Chilliwack on Google. I think we're there. And if you have any story ideas, you can email them to go underscore Fraser Valley at Shaw.ca. And as for me, my mom's going to love that. Oh, you're going to give that to your mom? Of course. Oh, lovely. Happy lovely. Easter.